It's that time of year again where the film festival vibe is blooming here in Jacksonville. So I'm hanging out with Adam and Monique, the founders of LOL Jack's Film Festival that doesn't just stand for Laugh Out Loud. It's for loving our locals. And it's taken me a long time to finally realize that, guys. So thank you for hyping me to that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no problem, no problem. Thanks for having us. <laughs> so, I mean, we talked a few months ago and it was like, hey, everybody come join the party, submit your films. And now it's like, Oh, your sub- films have been submitted. Now it's time to make the award presentations. Yes, yes. We can't wait. We're really excited. Yeah, we're really excited about this year, too, year five. I mean, it's it's like I said, it's come and now we're ready for it. So, you know, yeah, we're excited. It's an open invite. Tell me what people can expect. Not only will you expect films made by local filmmakers here in Jacksonville, filmed in Jacksonville, but you'll also get to see local stand-up comedians, and you also get to see bands on certain nights. So on August 13th, Jeremy Ryan will be performing. Uh, Nick Harvey will be our comedian for the night, along with our host, Jen Weeks. That's on the 13th. Uh, we'll have a 360 uh, kind of photo booth. It's kind of trending right now, so we're bringing that on board with um, Bracy Photos. Thanks to them. And then on the 15th, we'll have Jen again, but we'll also have Chris Buck, who's a stand-up comedian, and we'll have our award ceremony with mm-hmm. a special host. Rance Adams. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we told you yet, yeah. but uh, it's, it's me. Not it's me. <laughs> no, I'm super excited because uh, years past, obviously, I, the scheduling wouldn't allow me to come out and check out the scene, but the highlights are amazing. And the way that people, the artists, the comedians and whoever and the fans embrace each other and come together to support each other and network. I'm super excited to uh, check that out firsthand. So 13th, 14th festival, like people are seeing the films and stuff, the award presentation, which is all about them. them. Yeah, it won't make it about me. But uh, what's that going to be like? So, yeah, um, so the awards presentation is going to be pretty awesome. And like I said, yeah, it's going to be so, yeah, we had a cra- crazy uh, weekend this weekend because it's going to be the 13th. The 14th is a Jaguars uh, game. And so we decided to have the, the award show on the 15th. So we're going to have because the- we're Jack fans and we want to support. So we switched the deck. No, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, so so no, the awards is going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, we're, we're, we're really excited about it. It's going to be right after uh, the screenings, uh, filmmaker Q&A mm-hmm. and uh and uh, like I said, they'll be upstairs on the rooftop um, and it's going to be a lot of fun. Like I said, we're going to have uh, some great awards handed out, you know, including uh, some crazy ones, you know, like best choreography, uh, like the best uh, special effects. So, yeah, it's going to be some really cool ones. But obviously the main ones like best actor, best actress, best film. Best LOL premiere. So that yes. means if they screen for the first time at our festival, that could win an award potentially for the best film. And what was great is we actually had a lot of the submissions were uh premiere uh mm-hmm. like I said, so they'll be the first time showing at LOL Jack's Film Festival so we're really excited nice so uh, generally uh how many films are people going to be able to see over the weekend um so they'll see uh 11 to 12 films but they'll also have two comedians per night and then they'll have a rooftop celebration of some form or fashion and then also um forgot to mention giveaways we have some sponsors that are giving away so we'll have four gift card giveaways from uh, Legacy in Action on the 13th. And on the 15th, we'll have a gift basket by the Realtors, the Hartley Group. Um, That's gonna be on the Sunday. But yeah, so we'll have giveaways for the audience too. And then also they can vote for Audience Choice Film um, uh, on each of these nights to pick and be a part of the process. So audience members get to be judges too in their own little way. Nice. What time uh, does each night start? So we got uh, doors open at 630 at Mosh. Um, the screenings will be at the Brian Gooding uh, Planetarium, uh, which is really cool. Uh, really cool experience, to, especially, you know, except for our film festival. Um, and uh, like the event will start at 730. Mm-hmm. Um, so like I said, so everyone, you know, like I said, come in. Um, like I said, you know, we'll be doing everything safe, uh, just like last year, you know, because with everything going on, uh, there's limited capacity. So, you know, there's going to be a lot of safe measures to take place, but at least, you know, said, yeah, yeah. So like I said, we're going to have a lot of fun. And again, we, you know, we, we can't thank enough to, like I said, the people that believed in us and rants, we thank you so much because you've been with us since day one, you know? Um, so we, so again, uh, again, thank you for being a part of that. And people like, uh, you know, people, the partnership at Mosh, uh, Kessa Creative, who's believed in us also since day one. And then also Florida Blue, who believes, you know, like in, in our vision, everything like that. So we, you know, we thank 
a lot of people that just like uh, believe in us and our friends and family too, you know, so thank you guys. Local, local, yeah. it's all local love. All right, people, support your locals. Adam, Monique, kudos for what you do. And I look forward to seeing you guys this weekend. Yes, can't wait, can't wait. Thank, thank you. you.